Yo, what's up, guys? Today, we're watching Kung Fu Panda the Dragon Knight. And if you guys want us to watch more Kung Fu Panda the Dragon Knight, then get this video to 13,000 likes. I don't want to watch more of it, though. And check out the Patreon for the uncut recording and exclusive content. Subscribe. Yo, they got the DreamWorks logo at the beginning of the show. If you're a TV show and you think you have the right to do something like that, you better be cooking. Once again, here, tell a poem. It's crazy it took them like 10 years for Jack Black to record for a f***ing Kung Fu Panda show. You think it's just because Jack Black has fallen on hard times? How could he be falling on hard times if he's literally Steve Minecraft? I feel like that question just answered itself. <laughs> China. What? That's the premise? It's Guy Fieri, diners, drive-ins, and dives? <laughs> that actually sounds awesome, though. Hold on. Jack Black going and just eating at random places in China would be an incredible series. Yo, that sounds awesome, bro. This is about to be the best f***ing show ever made, man. Wait, it looks like a f***ing takeout box. Chinese takeout box. I realized why this show was made the way it was. They were in the writing room. He was executive producer. They were deciding what to do for the show. Jack Black, he post-mated Chinese food, and it was running late. It was all he could think about. He's like, f*** it, okay? No kissing. Nice to see you. I named my third child I after you. This is the most recent one, and I think it might look the worst. No, it does not. You're forgetting how bad the Pause of Destiny looked, bro. You're being ignorant to the facts of reality, Core. <laughs> This one kind of continues after the third one where like he's the dragon master and everyone knows him. But in Kung Fu Panda 4, they literally forgot that Poe is the dragon master when he went to the biggest city. And like no one knew who he was. It's very confusing. Fuck them for not paying attention to the lore of Kung Fu Panda, the Black Knight or Knight of what? The Dark Knight. The Goblin! Now hold that thought. Dude, are you fucking kidding me? What is the door physics here? I don't understand, bro. Whoa, what the, the evil weasels? They're gonna kill Poe. He's got the gauntlet! So far, this feels like the same quality as the other two Kung Fu Panda shows. I mean, I like this one more than Pause of Destiny, because with Pause of Destiny, we just fall around four random fuck-ass children we don't even care about. At least this one, we're watching Poe. I already forgot they were in that show. <laughs> oh my goodness, he's got the gauntlet. And then he snaps, and half of the people die. Poe just becomes Thanos, and he's just hungry. He's like, I'll solve world hunger. Here we go. This season's set in China in the middle of, like, a famine. And he's like, well, more for me this way. <laughs> I don't know what character that is, but they run like a Roblox character. Poe does not know the word aerodynamics. That's way above his vocabulary level. He's an idea, my little pandy. Ah! Jump scare. That looks like Avril Lavigne from Over the Hedge, bro. Cinematic parallels. You don't think it looks like Avril Lavigne from real life? I'm watching Sad Poe right now. Some gay Eastern European shit right here. Something y'all wouldn't really know about. Let the Dragon Master give you a hand with that. No thanks. That is not a Kung Fu Panda character. What in the name of Nintendo dogs just walked across the screen? I was just trying to destroy our village. You're a master at that. And the Wukau Gauntlet is gone. Damn, he got his ass handed to him by two weasels. He's not the dragon warrior. Like, I don't care what title you were given. If you can't fight two weasels that are a tenth of your size, you are not the dragon warrior, buddy. Oh my god, the gauntlet. It's Hand City. It's Hand City. Wait, if, if it's Hand City, then where are the palm trees? <laughs> the Empress taking away your title of Dragon Master. What? They took away his title. This show is insane. There's so much lore. Why is there so much lore in this? This is so serious all of a sudden. I'm so used to the tie-in shows, like, not mattering at all for the plot. Is that allowed? Like, didn't he, like, with Master Ugwe in heaven or something? You can't just take away his dragon warrior title. You destroy one city and they take away your shit, dude. That literally looks like a fucking Roblox character, dude. That is actually my Roblox skin. Put the text above their head, bro. <laughs> is this bacon hair really gonna try and fight my Kung Fu Ponda? Whoa, that's a lot of whatnot. 
<laughs> That's a lot of whatnot. <laughs> I do think this is an interesting clash, though, because, you know, the knight in armor with the big sword, it's like a European way of fighting at this time, while every other character is at least supposed to fight in, like, a Chinese kind of way. Oh, they're here to colonize. Wait, isn't the show called and the Black Knight or whatever? This is the Black Knight. It's the Dragon Knight. I'm a knight. She's kind of bad, though. She is not kind of bad. Jack, be quiet. She is not bad at all. She's kind of attractive. I'm looking for the Dragon Master. And she's British, too. I told you she was European. So she is a colonizer. Just because she's British doesn't mean she's a colonizer. I think it does. Yeah, but the British did colonize China. No, they didn't. When did they do that? <laughs> Name five of their albums, fucking asshole. Name five countries Britain colonized. It'll be easy. Daughter of the Saxon God, Knight of England. Is she straight up just from? England? Wait, it, wait, other countries exist? In this world, like, I only ever thought of China existing. Like, the fact that they just straight up are like, yeah, England exists and it's full of people. Hold on. Yes? Aren't they kind of flirty, though, with it? I feel like they could be a beautiful couple together, to be honest with you. We can't ship Poe with every single woman he comes in contact with. How many women has he come into contact with? Tigress, the fat one, this one, what, Aquafina? Okay, now that, you, now that you spell it out, I guess we have shipped Poe with a couple women. Because I'm sort of still the dragon master. <laughs> there should be more scenes where in the script it says, let Jack Black do his own thing for 10 seconds. Like, that would make the show like a hundred times even better, bro. And maybe they like don't even script the show. Just let Jack Black come into the studio and say anything he wants and then construct an episode out of that. I lost something. Yo, what is this Bollywood editing? No way we got that zoom in back in like that. Am I watching RRR or something? That was kind of a hard title drop, Loki. Kind of goaded with the sauce. Okay, I, I will at least say I like that the, the show has a story. Like, it actually has a plot. No, 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 no. I know it's an L word. Um, Lorelai. Honestly, I forgot her name too, so I'm kind of on his side. What is her name? I actually, I forgot her name as well. <laughs> I kind of like what they did with the TV show, though, because obviously they couldn't use the same villains as any of the movies or anything. Instead of making, like, any of the villains Chinese, they just made them all European. That's more believable, if anything. She's kind of like Jinx from Arcane. No, she's not. This is our river. Is that Will Arnett? Why does he sound like that? No way they got Will Arnett to voice in this show. He wasn't even in any of the movies. It doesn't sound anything like Will Arnett. Glowy felt weird. Hey, oh. oh my god, this makes so much sense because we were theory crafting that it was going to be all about him traveling all across China and eating a bunch of food. But actually, he has a green thumb, so he's going to plant the food. It's going to be three seasons of him developing a rice field. Watch The Rock. And that was actually Jack Black shouting out one of his friends in the industry, The Rock. So honestly, round of applause for Jack, just being such a nice guy. You've been hiking for three hours and I caught up to you in one. When does the Black Knight show up? There is no Black Knight. There's a Dragon Knight. We're not playing the Black Knight for the Nintendo Wii right now, and this is the opening cutscene. We're Sonic. We're Sonic. Like, I, technically, she's a brown bear. It shouldn't be called the Black Knight, then. It should be called the Brown Knight. It's not called the Black Knight. <laughs> Uh, looks tasty. They have such a great dynamic. I like when Poe says something and then the bear is like, I don't care and I don't like you. Well, just give her a second. She's warming up to him, okay? You got to think about how dangerous it must be for a woman to visit another country like this. She's got to have her guard up. Oh. Oh my! She's not ready for spice because she's white. She's what? She's from England, bro. She hasn't tasted flavor before. They put salt and pepper on her bread, and she's like actually seizing. This sword was forged with the black steel of the equinox. Black steel? Black, black knight, knight, right? Steel of the equinox. That is so fun to say. Try saying that. I'm not gonna lie. I like their dynamic. She takes everything very seriously, and he can't stop joking around. So it leads to clashes in their personalities, which leads to humor. As as a result, like I feel like it's it's pretty textbook. You sound like an executive trying to convince me that the show's good, but I'm not enjoying it. Luthera of Landreth, the Wandering Blade, daughter of the Saxon God, Knight of England. Ever since I played Dark Souls a couple years ago, like I'm 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 sympathetic towards the Europea boo, like the obsession with with titles and European armor. I understand the hype. I understand the hype. No, no, it is cool. I just think it's like morally the right thing to do to make fun of it. These silly shortcuts and get me to the. This rip 
<gasps> this is just like Shrek where it's the bridge and the lava. Poe is the donkey. Is Poe gonna date a dragon and have children with it? Well, she's a dragon knight and he's a dragon warrior. So together they'll have a child and it'll be a dragon black knight. It'll be a black child. You kind of got to get used to saying we. Go home, Poe. This is my home. I'm the Chinese one. You're the settler. You're the conqueror. How about you leave my lands? <gasps> he kills himself. She said one negative thing about him. Kills himself instantly. Wait, maybe he has like, like a degradation fish. Like he needs like a, a more powerful woman to degrade him before he's willing to do something cool. Well, that's what's good about this is that she has to learn how to trust people because she has trust issues because her father abandoned her when she was a young bear. Behind you! Yo, this is a fucking awesome two-player video game level right here. This would be so annoying, though. You have to hold a rope and let the NPC cross while also fighting all of these guys. Shouldn't she just, like, walk over? Like, she had all this time to just walk. I was just like, walk faster. Like, I will admit, I am engaged in this fight scene. And this is a, a really interesting fight choreography. Just the whole idea of it. This is this kind of reminds me of the bridge fight in the first movie that, like, initially blew me away. I wish this show had the action animation of Legends of Awesomeness. Yeah, because the action animation was good in Legends of Awesomeness. But everything else was, you know, uh, uh, <laughs> uh. <laughs> He slid on lava. That's not like ouch, ouch hot. Ouchy. That's like I'm dead. Like I am dead. It's a little ouchy. It's like hot water, you know? It's like ouchy. Ouchies. I just touched molten lava. I'll hold them back. Yoink. Yoink. <laughs> Yoink. There is no way to say yoink. Yoink. That was awesome. This show desperately needed this character. Like he's the only thing that makes me smile. What? That's not how physics works. If he kicked her, he would be pushed back with the same amount of force that he kicked her with. So he would fly to the right. He wouldn't just stay in the same place. No, you see, this is a special kind of ability. It's called Poe Motion. I am the rock. No, you're not. You're, you're Jack, Jack Black. Black. I love it when we think the exact same thing during a recording core. It really shows how unique we are as people. I am a very unique individual. The thumb wakes up when they use the gauntlet. Seems safe to say. How many episodes does this show have? One million. You know, this show is the longest show ever. It's longer than The Simpsons. It's longer than A Family Guy. Uh, it's longer than every other show. They started making in the 90s, and it's just been running continuously ever like since. One more episode. One more episode. So, so, so. Ow! What's now, Jen? Cramp! Do you think it's because I'm working too hard? Are these the animators? You gotta get one of those the animation gloves. <laughs> those don't help your hand, Grant. They're just so your hand doesn't get stuck on the screen. Oh, I thought it was to help with your hand. They do make stuff like that for Carpal Tunnel, but uh... That's a snake oil. It doesn't actually work. Yeah, Carpal Tunnel isn't even a real thing. True. <laughs> I'm honestly completely shocked that this is a TV series and it's like one episode picks up after the other. Didn't the last Kung Fu Panda show? Kind of. And it was just Ninjago. This show feels like there's like actual legitimate stakes to it. It's so much more narrative driven than any other children's TV show from movie I've seen. Leave it. There's no time to pick up your miserable junk. Not junk. It took more time for her to say that sentence than it took for him to pick it up. No, the hedgehogs. No, I think they got to run fast. They got to run faster. Editor, can you let this guy drop a bunch of coins when he falls? Edit so he, he hits the ground. He drops coins. Actually, editor, don't do that. I'm not going to make you do a bunch of work for no reason. But make sure you leave in the fact that I said you don't have to do that. So people remember that I'm nice to the editors. Editor, put this in. Lip sync to Eden. You suck, editor. Make Eden say that. This is the best show ever made. They could have copy pasted the sound bite from the opening of Legends of Awesomeness. It sounded the same. Sweet. <laughs> oh shit, I get it. It's because he's fat. Uplifting fat joke moment. Well, 
clearly her sparklers and poppers were a gateway to that. This is just one random person that they had it out for. And we're gonna execute this hedgehog tomorrow morning. Leaving her in jail means Klaus and Veruca will destroy another city and another. I understand it's just a show and you shouldn't take it seriously, but it's like, they need to do a better job of suspending my disbelief because I'm like, where are the Furious Five? How is Poe struggling with two weasels? Give me a reason to believe what is going on. I'm begging you, please. All he has to do is say sweet again and I think you won't be thinking about those sort of things. True. They just need to dangle the keys for us again, then we won't think. No way. I'm not fighting monks. Clearly has not seen Wonka starring Timothy Chalamet. Everybody knows that monks are just very naturally violent people. And they're bald. And they're bald, so. They're kind of asking for it at that point. Yep. Hurry up. I'm not good at being bad, okay? Hey, what do you mean you're not good at being bad? You bad as hell, Po. You, uh, you freeing our prisoner there? Yeah, yeah, you, uh, you freeing him? What, uh, what you doing there? Why do they sound like that? <laughs> this dialogue is so weird. A surprise? Yeah, because it's her, uh, birthday? Bro, Poe is spitting with the improv. So he sent me ahead to make sure she didn't eat cake. Sure, sure, a lot of carbs. Yeah, sugar too. Yeah, just uh, sugars are carbs. Oh, is that right? Yeah, a lot of people don't know that. Well, we had that com- We literally had that conversation like a month ago, Jack. Thanks a lot, Panda. You've made our jobs a lot easier. I'm sorry, I did the best that I could. Poe is such a pussy in this show. You're right, Eden. He literally falls over once and he's like, Wah, I can't defeat these four rhinos. You went to heaven and beat God, bro. And now you're losing to four rhinos? Like, you have to get your little mommy to go ask for no pickles? <laughs> He looks so gay. He looks so fat. He was He's so, so fat, fat and gay, and gay when gay. he ran. Remember when we used to just say fake and gay like regularly as a as a cultural people? Ray William Johnson was the one saying it, not me. Play the clip where Ray William Johnson has the lightsaber. Damn. Dude, we've played that clip like 50 times. Did that hedgehog really just moan and go uppies? Uppies, uppies. We freed you. Now tell us what you saw. I saw them steal a scroll. The people are just stealing scrolls. Like in the Paws of Destiny, that's what the villains did too. The world was one great landmass. Pangea. There are no humans on Pangea. Well, they're animals though. And guess what they are, Eden? Oh, shit. You're right. It's not Kung Fu human, bro. The elements were thrown off balance and the world split apart. So the reason Pangea separated is not because of like any continental drift or anything. It's just like some guys with magic powers were like kind of evil. Thanos did it. Thanos did it. Well, we have an unreliable narrator right now. Like what they're saying probably isn't even true. She was a prisoner, right? We can't trust a prisoner, even if they were falsely incarcerated, right? Yeah, why were they in jail, huh? If they were so good. They were scattered, so no one could have this power again. Yeah, they just left one as a question mark, so you gotta keep watching the show if you wanna find out what it is. Is it four seasons? Each season, they have to find one gauntlet. Isn't there only three seasons? There is only three, so they never finished the show. Did they not finish the plot of the show? Chad is saying that they did finish the plot course, so you are ignorant and spreading misinformation right now. And then someone else said they just don't finish the plot, so now we have conflicting opinions in our chat right now. Fictional drawings for children. We prefer the term graphic novel, and it's based on fact. Jack Black thought he was gonna get the kids with that one. The kids are gonna love that joke, because I'm like with them. It's actually a well-developed art form, thank you very much. To be continued, I hate when it says Yo, we chose a good place to end, bro. This shit better than Gravity Falls. Can we be honest? Honestly, we could just keep watching this show. If this video gets views, I would be down to just keep watching this show. So glad you guys are gonna do it. Aeromare, Alex McLean, Alzheimer's is a bad disease. We should cure it. Andrew Husky, Arachnidroid, Aaron Tates, and Atomic Leon Vento, Blake Rivera, Kane Rivers, Tom Luke, Cosmic Dega, Crystal Bunny, Frozen Spaghetti, Gabriel Grenados, Gub Stargazer, Gurney Snile Yernison, Happy and Egg, Helio, Histrionics Ribbler, Honor Pearson, Hummus, Hydropon, Isaiah Alfred, K99, Kamui, King of the Street, Lilac Moon, Loka Pegged, Brett Hand, Michael. Michael Rodriguez, Milan Zekanovic, Merck, Native, Omega Waffles, Oscar Annis, Pablo the God, Patrick Case, Randolph, Pizza Loving Panda, R. Dizel, Rocky Road with Sprinkles, Rathoka, Quinn Christian, Sam, Skyler is Milk's Mama, Kieran Sills, Tyler Russell, Val Explicit, Victoria.